This is your host, Kosa Raspel, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance. In the last episode, we finally finished up Sora's uh, part of the adventure that we can do, and therefore have started Riku's, for lack of a better way to say it. And, yeah, just as I've said... Just as I said in the original, uh, well, not in the original, as I said, playing as, uh, Sora, we were, the reason why we played as Sora for, what is it now, we played as him for, like, five episodes straight, the reason why is because now Riku is insanely powerful, and I know I'm probably repeating myself a heck ton, I, I understand that, um, but it, it's all for good, uh, good show now. Now everything I've been talking about can finally come to fruition. Oh boy. And I'm lost. Okay, well there's a link portal up to the... I didn't get that? No, I didn't get that. Come on and slam! But yeah, combat combat feels great if you finally get into the groove of this game. The story I've already talked about when it came to like Tron's world and all that, it gets a little bit convoluted. But other than that, the story is easy enough to follow. Without using trial commands, no problem. Actually, because these are big enemies, I can just do this. You said no triangle, said nothing about my slams. Come on, what do I get? Ten? Yeah, this is still the first world, so I should only be getting like ten or so from it. I need to stick close to the ground so enemies actually pop up, because Riku, while powerful right now, still needs to level. I could wind up in a situation where, well, oh, I don't know what either, either of these do. Right, Riku doesn't uh, gain special attacks, he absorbs the spirits and starts going crazy with them. I actually don't know which I which I prefer. Uh, the special attacks are unique to Sora, but this is far more similar to the uh, oh what is it the drop um, not the drive system. And I can't look at my map when I'm transformed. But why not? Oh right, I have to head south. And hey, that was the last, uh, uh, Link I needed. So, let's... No, not trading toys. Oh, goodness. These menus. I linked with them five times. So now I get the last rank of combo plus. I'm still gonna have him in my team because he's the most powerful spirit I have. The next spirit, like, just in case anyone wants to know what I'm up to, uh... The next spirit I want to make is r, r Seal. He's got some good skills, but I need to find those items to make him. Because he gives second chance. Or is it once more? I believe it's second chance. Which, you need that. To live. Wait. Oh no, I was supposed to head north! What am I doing with my life? Sorry, that has nothing to do with the game. I just had a moment of self-reflection. Oh, not this way. Come on, Q, you just looked at the map. You know the way to go, don't you? Oh man, I have to go up?
Yeah, now we're somewhere. And to mix things up, I think uh, once I start getting a varied amount of commands and such, I'm going to make Riku a more attack-focused character and Sora a more magic-focused character. No reason in particular. One is not better than the other. I just wanted to uh, do it for variety's sake. Like, I'll give Sora Blizzaga, Fyraga, Balloonga, and I'll get rid of that from Riku once we get some good skills. Because right now, I don't have any, like, I got, what, Sliding Dash? Fire Windmill is pretty good. Yeah, I guess I could replace Balloonra with Fire Windmill if I really wanted to do that, but let's face it, Balloonra is just better right now. And I know it may seem like I'm using Shock... What is it? Shock Dive a little bit too much, and I probably am. And I'm not sorry for it. Uh, but... What can I say? It's OP. No, I don't want that. Strength and defense, because Riku... Yeah, at this point, Riku needs that. Where Sora absolutely needed that. He would have... Sora's probably... Like, if Sora had any idea what Riku is up to at this given moment... Holy crap, he'd be jealous. I'm, I forget where I'm supposed to go. I'm gonna go near the Flick Rush Coliseum, because... I bet you the game wants me to really know where that place is. Why is there a whole, like, carnival section that looks like the Dream Eater should go there? It's like a Dream Eater's bar. Let's see. Can I, like, get it right in the middle? I got most things. This is such a good skill uh, to start, like, new players off with. I wonder if Riku's stats affect those at all. That's something I've never really tested. If your stats actually affect the, uh... Actually, what are those called? The ones, th like... The fantasy... The reality shifts, that's it. Even though we're not even in the reality. Oh god, Over my there. cat. What? Hey! We should stick together. <laughs> Perfect. You can't expect me to... And this is the scene that uh, Sora saw much earlier. No way. How did you get here? Who are you? Uh. By choice or chance, you cannot control what you are not aware of. This wakeless sleep will be your prison to wander forever. What do you mean? Riku! Don't you listen to that punk! Cheeky's gonna be fine. She told me what's up. Hoodie here set this whole thing up, yo. He promised to send Cheeky back to our world, and you was the cost of travel. Yo, this is seriously one half-baked excuse for a mission. To be fair, Neku... Even a <laughs> Neku fell for it as well. Obviously he's not a reaper. He doesn't have wings. All right. Who are you? Wait. Uh. 
You all take a really, really long time to go up to people I'm in really portals. Sorry, uh, it's alright. Beat. Watch her. I got this, yo. Oh, we're just starting with the boss fight right away? Yes! Oh, this this place is beautiful. I think I'd actually enjoy coming here. You know, if it weren't for the giant monsters and whatnot. No worries. Oh no, I'm just trying to attack normally, game. I don't really have very... Oh, there's treasure. I know I shouldn't uh, be focusing too much on that. I do not have a lot of ranged options to be fighting this guy. And of course, I got like three ranks of... Oop! This n might knock him down to the ground. Maybe enough for a spark dive? Yeah! Oh, do it again, do it again. Open treasure because I am a greedy, greedy person. And now we get the Skull Noise Keyblade, correct? Well, after a couple of cutscenes, I suppose. Yeah, that was the boss. Challenging, I know. I, oh, like, it has probably been about a week since I played this, played this part as Sora. So, I forget if I actually had this much trouble. Can we see each other? We see. This is so messed up, man. She's right here in front of me, and I can't reach her. If your hearts are connected, you'll reach her. Neku. Sora. Ah, oh, we all got our partners. It's great. Skull noise. Okay. Lots of rotation going on for no reason. Oh yeah, and this is the part where, uh, like, sure, world, Joshua. Oh, their to does end. Riku know Joshua? Yes, he Riku met Joshua first. I gathered up the very last remnants of their dreams and looked for a place to give them refuge. <laughs> Sorry, my cat wants my attention. Then, this world appeared to answer my call. Nala, don't make me and redo Ryan's the whole episode just because you're getting a little bit antsy because Here, I'm not paying attention I to you. They might have a chance. That the pieces of their dreams could make them whole again. Imagine my surprise when I realized dreams take bodily form in this world. It struck me by linking their dream pieces back together that maybe I could make them exist again. Maybe I could give them another chance. It can't be that simple. No <laughs> wonder if Sora's really being that. Can can they see each other? Like, is this conversation going on at the same time? So much rotation. That's the moment we each start to exist. All they needed was for someone to see them, connect with them, and the two of you were a big part of making it happen. Joshua, just who are you? Okay, so they can move at the same time. Let's say, a friend. Friend is a very strong word. Okay. We're just going to accept this. Just like we'll accept everything else. Huh. 
I forget if that happened in Sora's playthrough. Well, not playthrough. Rendition. I don't know how, what you would call it. From here, though, things will get a little bit more interesting because... While we are going through the same worlds, we're not going to be doing anything that Sora did uh, on his journey. We're going to be going through One our own rendition. Is connected to another. Our own chapter, which if you will, a side story. In which sleeping world you will begin. I will return you to the Destiny Islands just before they were swallowed by the darkness and plunged into sleep. Once dreams take you, you must let them guide you to the sleeping worlds. As there are seven pure lights, there are seven sleeping keyholes. Unlocking these will both grant you new powers and free the worlds from their wakelessness. Complete this task and return here safely. And I will name you both True Masters. We'll get back to that. So yes, next we're going to be going directly to La Cité des Cloches. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Could they not just say Notre Dame? Is that really that illegal? Like, I honestly don't know. Like, is that trip? Like, like, are you not allowed to just say, like, is that a certain amount of money you have to pay for to just say Notre Dame? got destroyed I, uh, another thing I have to look into is does it, having like extra like will being higher level uh, affect affect that gold which means I got a water barrel not the best thing but I mean I'll take it Stop her. it's useful I'll say that You there? Have you seen a gypsy woman? Nope. Sorry. All right. Thanks. I'm terribly sorry, sir. We've lost her. Mm, slippery vermin. I'm beginning to question having summoned you back from the wars, Captain Phoebus. I feel like that's unnecessary exposition we did not need for that character. Also, I feel that statement I just said was redundant. You stood up for me. I'm Esmeralda. Riku. And it's not like I know what a gypsy is. Why are they chasing you? Judge Frollo has been hunting us for years. We gypsies are guilty of nothing but loving our freedom. Yet Frollo hates whatever he can't control. Now he's even brought in fresh blood to torment us. I'd hate to know what darkness drives that man. I think I can imagine. Yes, yes you can. Tell me more. Was he always like this? I don't give Frollo much thought. But, if you'd like, you could try Notre Dame. They say it's a place for answers. Not the answers like that.
Uh, apologies for the cut. My cat needed to be fed. That's the reason she was getting all antsy earlier and yelling at me. Oh boy, this part of town. I, I come on, game. Stop making me fight enemies in the middle of town, where there's almost nothing I can do besides combo. At least this time, I'm powerful in terms of how much damage I'm dishing out. Let's uh, go for some Shining Hammer, shall we? Wait, that's a Link Portal. Oh, come on. I'm busy here. Can't you see that, you cat? There's more. Oh, they killed it. Good job. 20 seconds are left. Eh, probably not going to happen with a wide open area like this and enemies uh, fleeing in fear. But I can try. I thought that prickle mane was mine for a few seconds. <laughs> I was just like, prickle mane? Uh huh. It's just walking past, finding the enemy. Wait a second, it's not red. <laughs> yeah, I should probably do one quick search around uh, the town just to see what items I can find. A balloon. Yeah, just to give you some idea of what the items do, balloons uh, for your uh, for your allies will mostly give you uh, XP. Water barrels will give them LP, and candy goggles give you a mix of like affinity. I think it's called. I actually don't know what the hearts are called. It could just be friendship. Uh, and also a tiny bit of XP as well. So really, balloons giving XP and water barrels giving LP. A lot of LP. Is Seriously, water barrels are not a bad way to grind that stuff. Who... who are you? I'm Riku. Oh, my name's Quasimodo. Oh god, he's staring oh, off in the sorry. distance. The That's RPG terrible RPG. animation. Actually, I'm looking for a man named Frollo. Do you know where he is? My master? He said he had business on the outskirts of the city. Do you mean you know him? Oh, yes. He's... he's very kind. Master Frollo saved my life. He protects me from the outside world. He protects you from it? The people out there would be cruel to me. Really, Frollo and would be... Monster, you know. Like, he would be super you? angry with him right now because he's talking to Riku. Looks can be deceiving. A good friend sees you for who you are, no matter what face you wear. You should go out there. Find some friends who understand you. Oh, no. My master forbids it. I'm not to set foot outside. You're also not supposed to talk to... I'm... Fairly certain he wasn't sure supposed to talk to anyone in the church. Because I think something he was supposed to hide away in the bell tower. Ask your heart, Quasimodo. I'll check the edge of town. Thanks. Wish I could take my own advice. Yay, that just makes you a hypocrite. <laughs> And slam and balloon ra. Oh, the lock on camera sometimes. Oh, that was a good shot. Better not waste it.
Yeah, I just feel like battles are going a lot smoother right now. I, I, I need to double check Sora's footage of the Hunchback level, but I feel like battles are going a lot smoother for Riku. Really, we'll, I'll mostly tell uh, once we hit the grid. Then again, it could also be a mix that, uh, you know, I have Balloon Run now. That could be a massive boon that's helping Riku. Because, you know, Balloon Run's great. And, you know, I did give this area, like... I have to say this. This is absolutely a million times inferior to the actual Hunchback of Notre Dame. But the landscape itself, for just being a level, it's, it's actually bright and colorful, and I'll give it that. I have absolutely nothing against the world itself. Because Kingdom Hearts, while th this, let's face it, this was um, the game to kind of be a stepping stone towards a bigger game. This was, this wasn't like, uh, this doesn't feel like it has the s same scope as Birth by Sleep. It feels like they wanted to get this out of the way before Birth by, S or before Kingdom Hearts 3 happened. It's like they, they had a story in mind for Kingdom Hearts 3, what would be the greatest final battle that they could possibly think of, and they needed a stepping stone to make sure that uh, we could get into the game as soon as Kingdom Hearts begins. And I don't really have a problem with that. It just mostly means that I feel like a lot of the game is... I don't know, it doesn't have the same heart to it. Take damage no more than two times, fair enough. Oh, but you got enemies on different levels. So I gotta be... Oh, that's a lot of... A lot of pandas. Stay away from me. And I got distracted. There we go. Okay, I am back once more. There was another cut there. I'm not sure if many people noticed. But that's because my cat knocked over the microphone and I had to... <laughs> delete all that stuff in the middle. I don't know what's up with her, but whenever I start recording, I swear, she's just like, Whoa! You paying attention to something that's not me? And look at me, I'm talking about my cat. Like I'm a crazy person. Well, no, talking to my cat would be a crazy person. I'm not crazy, I'm simply talking to myself in front of a microphone as I play a game where I'm running around a dream world. A dream leader. And a big one. I'm not crazy, I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> oh, it's great. What? This is fair. No use. I gotta run for it. <laughs> oh! Riku's got the snarky attitude that I got. Oh, like, this is fair. No problem! Smash enemies, too! Really, I don't see the difference between, like, this and everything else. I mean, sure, there's gonna be a couple of explosions, but I got Cure. Oh, right, those explode. Oh. Sorry, game, I... Oh, come on. I need the XP. Oh, whoops. 
I need to be careful. Do I have Leaf Bracer yet? If not, I need to double check because I might actually have enough Link Points for Meow Wow to get that now. Of course, I can't do it now because the Wargoyle is trying to make mincemeat of me. Yes, more strength for Ow. I was afraid I smacked those barrels for a bit there. Did not mean to use that, but I guess I was going to use that pretty soon anyway. Okay, that war coil just won't give up, will he? I have to say, this is a little bit more exciting than when uh, Sora went just through the dungeons for, like, no reason. Or not the dungeon, the cemetery. Defiling who knows how many graves, but who cares, it's Sora. That is most certainly not where I'm supposed to go, so, well, that's not a challenge. And I'm avoiding using these as shortcuts because I do want to fight enemies. And I want to look for treasure. Because, hey, drop me not. I'm using plenty of those. I'm not, I'm not trying to, I'm trying to hit the flower. If you would call that a flower. I'd call that a flower because the game calls it a flower. But besides that, slam! No problem. Yeah, the, the, uh... The war goal is barely a concern, to be honest. Ocean. I mean, he is a concern. Do keep an eye out for him. But you can just walk around his attacks, and don't forget, you can just come back here later. Stand aside, Captain Venus. I will not. What have these people done wrong? I have proof this family gave harm to gypsies. That's not a crime. I can think of few crimes that are greater. No. Oh. What demon is this? Oh, you are mistaken, Captain Phoebus. This is no demon. It is righteous judgment. I have been granted this power so that I may smite all gypsies now and forever. This is all wrong. He won't listen. Once you've fallen that far, there's almost no coming back. Riku, how about you tell him about the time that you came back then? I am a virtuous man. Good and evil shall be made plain. Once the gypsies face the fires of judgment. <laughs> <laughs> I like that they just had to show us the mouth flaps of him just no, laughing like that. Hey, that went about as well as I expected. At least it's wearing armor. You all right? Well, can't say you didn't warn me. You Don't worry. Me. Let a child I'll take care of this. Thanks. I gotta tell you, this is embarrassing having to rely on a kid. You wouldn't be the first. 
Sorry. I'll admit, you look more capable than me right now. All right. Be careful. It looks like that creature is heading for the cathedral. Okay. Got it. So I gotta go back. You've come to Paris in her darkest hour, Captain. It will take a firm hand to save the weak-minded from being so easily misled. Misled? Sir? For 20 years, I have been taking care of the gypsies. And yet, for all my success, they have thrived. I believe they have a safe haven within the walls of this very city. What are we going to do about it, sir? Stamp them out. One by one. You make your point quite vividly, sir. Yes, we have to go back. Meaning all that uh, traverse... Ooh, water barrel. All that traversing with uh, the war goil and me stepping around it a lot. Pretty much useless. Oh, I can't. Oh, wait. I can jump off of these guys. And slam. Looks like they need another. I guess Balloonra doesn't really work on smaller targets too much. Block at least three attacks? Oh, come on. At least these guys are easy to block. Come on. Careful not to actually die. There we go. Give me all those sweet droplets, game. I love it. I'm thinking I'm going to make this one a longer episode simply because I don't have time to make another episode today. Ooh, that seemed like a good one. Oh, is that... Ooh. Okay, enemies. Oh, they're all dead. <laughs> Calm down, Q. No need to pull out balloon rod right every given moment. Let's see. Uh, I got some new commands, which are interesting. Sonic Impact. Sliding Crescent. I can replace Jump with High Jump. Do I got guard? Yeah, I got this. Wait, what? Counter... Oh, Sora only. Okay, okay. Oh, and I do have an extra s slot on my command deck. Let's just move this here and that... Oh, come on. And let's give him drain dive. More dives. Oh, right off the bat with this. I wonder what causes me to get reality shifts. Yeah. 
And by the way, if you guys were ever curious, something that uh, I would like to do is longer episodes. I know, I already make these like like 45 minutes, but I liked it when I made things like Yakuza 0, and I had like 8 hours to kill every day uh, for episodes, and I could just cut them down and make them nice and long and always jam-packed full of content. That was... To me, I, I remember fondly playing Yakuza 0, except for that grind near the end of the game. But that was my choice to do that grind, by the way. I, I will not say that the game got grindy. But yeah, I, I remember that pretty fondly. Nope. I, I, ho I hope, like, some hardcore Kingdom Hearts fan is watching this and just going like, Wait, you're using Shock Dive for, like, every single fight. You call yourself a good Kingdom Hearts player? No, I call myself a good Kingdom Hearts 2 player. I don't... I, I barely know how to play this game. <laughs> like, I do not know the ins and outs. I don't, like... He here's what I do know. And it's what I've been following. One, I know that r, &R Seal gives me second chance. I know that a certain dinosaur uh, Dream Eater spirit will give me once more. Which those are the skills that will net me uh, my, the ability to not die. Hopefully. Um... And I knew how to get combo plus. I still don't know how to get air combo plus. Like, I do need to look that up. But it's fine. I don't... I technically don't need... Uh, air combo plus to beat the game. I don't need any... Well, I do need second chance to beat the game. I need that. You guys don't understand. Co em enemies comboing you to death in unavoidable combos is frequent. It will happen at the end game. So, please. Please don't make this hard on yourself. You need that skill. Like... I actually beat the game without once more last time I played this, but there was no way in heck it is even possible to... I mean, I'm sure there's someone who will go like, nah, you don't need a uh, second chance. Look at these skills I have. I'm sure someone's like that. I'm not. It's like telling me you can beat Dark Souls without dying. I'm sure it's possible. I can't. <laughs> That's part of the game. I wonder how I'm doing on droplets. This is where I came from. Good job, me. Yeah, this is just a quick travel across the city. Really, there should be an item up here. Oh, there is! I did not know that was there. And I just used the drop me not accidentally again. What is wrong with me? It's because to activate that thing you have to press triangle and circle at the same, same time. So I may accidentally use a skill or an item, but I need to always make sure I don't have Drop Me Not selected. Hey, I'm, I just got another Drop Me Not, so I'm not, I'm not gonna beat myself up over it. And besides, I was going to use that Drop Me Not. Let's face it, guys, I'm not gonna get through the grid and Prankster's Paradise and the rest of this. Uh, without using at least one more drop me not. Block of chocolate. Uh, I need to stop getting those. 
Like those food items. Because yes, I, I will probably be using some of these spirits. I could use these spirits, these specific spirits throughout the entire game and not be affected too much. That's not an issue. What is an issue is um, like the fact that I need the important recipe items to make things like r and seal. Oh, I never checked if I got Leaf Bracer. That's right. Oh, hey there. How's it going? Everything's on fire for right? like, why? I'm fine. Thanks to Quasimodo. Quasimodo. Where did the creature go? It's, it's up there. Right. Wait. Wait, I'll go with you. Thanks, but stay with her. Quasimodo. Did your heart have the answer? Time and place. Heartfelt moment. Time and place, please. Like, everything is just on fire. And the whole church could burn down. <laughs> well, I guess you three got this covered. Let's not... Well, it was a walk in the park. <laughs> Let, let's not question this whatsoever. Yeah, but... Aw, oh, give me a break. Is this a figure of speech? Both of you pipe down and get ready, because here comes some old. Yeah. It's up there. <laughs> we're just not gonna question the gargoyles. This is the first time Riku has saw them. And we're just like, yeah, normal. I didn't explore this uh, church very much the first time I was here, did I? No, I kind of just left immediately. Which is a bad idea, because sometimes that's important items. Fyra, yes. We're gonna make Sora a magic-based character. We're gonna need stuff like that. Funny, there's fire outside and I just got Fyra, yeah. I was about to shock dive because I saw my own spirit spawn. I need to be careful. <laughs> Well, it's not like I can hurt my own spirits, but I'm just like, I I just have a trigger finger for that right now. Yeah, he does have balloon rod. That's awesome. He grows up so fast. Heck, I might keep him because of that. And by the way, I actually know that the, uh... Hold on, I need to get Leaf Bracer. I need to stop distracting myself from that. And heck, if he gets to level 25, I could have just given him Kiraga right there. But he doesn't, so let's just grab, like, Defense Boost over here. Item boost. I wonder if that actually affects... Uh... Oh, what is it? What's this? Confusing strike? I'm not gonna use that. I might link with him still, but I'm not gonna use that. Magic haste, that's good. Zero gravera, that's good. I forgot what I was saying, though. Yeah, I needed to... And I still never equipped Skull Noise. Jeez, what is wrong with me? Like, I could have just been doing more damage and more magic. So, more more damage.
Item. Gotta get that item. Where am I trying to go again? Staircase. Oh, it's that's right. I forgot. It's near the beginning of this uh, church. The boss was right here. <laughs> yes, let it burn. The flames will consume everything. You see, this is the power that has just poke him in the butt. Me. I see a sad old man with a dark heart. Again, you are wrong. Now you will be judged, just like the rest! You're Ansem! Why are you here? Your best friend is never far. So sad. The cost of yielding to the darkness. You could write a book about that. <laughs> he did! I embrace the darkness. And unless you hurry up and learn to do the same... <laughs> he did write a book about that. The Ansem Report. Like I walk the road to dawn. Still afraid of the dark, I see. Again, everyone just kind of like watches as they walk through portals, and Riku's gonna go, Wait! Wait! <laughs> I didn't see! He always. <laughs> they, they wait no. too long, and no, then they well, scream, the Wait! As he's going through the, the portal. Way. Every time. Oh. I can ride the heat blast. Well, those don't look like heat blasts. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, blade charge. Oh, I can ride this. That's what it means. Dude, Blade Charge is so cool. This is just like Aqua's from uh, Dream Drop Distance. I know how to activate Reality Shifts game. Balloon Run, kill him. And I think I might have used a Drop Me Not during that battle. I was spamming Triangle a lot. So, uh, we gonna put out the fire? Confetti! Yay! Everyone's dead. Master Frollo, he made me live inside the bell tower, but the real walls were the ones I built around my heart. You helped me see that, Riku. I was speaking from personal experience. I'd say you still keep a lot locked inside. We all do that sometimes. There are just some things we need to keep separate from the world at large. At least until we have time to figure them out. <sighs> uh. 
I know the road my heart walks. Ah, I just shoot the Keyblade Blast already. We got a... We got a confusing world to go to. At least it's less confusing when Riku's there. Because he's not trying to get through to Tron or anything. He's just... There. Hey, Axel. You haven't forgotten. Hmm? What? You made us a promise. I did? That you'd always be there. To bring us back. Yeah. You said that to Shion. Got it memorized? <laughs> Best friends forever. Where? What happened to me? Roxas. That's me. Dylan. Alias. Evan. Yenzo. the ones who joined the organization here. I guess Xehanort doesn't count. But where are Break and... Isa? Ooh, we got some plot going on there. So yeah, the organization 13 members that were there... Well, are people again, just like they said. So yeah, next we're gonna dive into the grid. Let's just finish up this with a dive. That way, the moment the next episode starts, we're right in there, ready to get going with the plot already in set. So yeah, it's kind of an interesting prospect that... Oh, right. <laughs> There's only one fry... Oh. But yeah, it's kind of interesting, because we did see that out uh, in the previous, or no, in this installment? I forget what it is, but in a installment, an installment, why did I say a installment, they said that Xehanort is coming back, and he did. He, like, all those, we've seen Xemnas and Ansem so far, and we... Oh, that, I didn't think that could actually hurt me. Nice. But we know that they're coming back, and so it makes sense that all the organization members we've destroyed up to this point have come back. There's the prize orb I need. Yeah, I don't care if I got a bronze. My clothes. Is this world special? A dream eater. No. Let's see how this plays out. Yeah, unlike Sora, who looked at that machine and was just like, Nope, 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 screw this, nope, nope, I'm not going with you, bye. Another stray. You know, I don't think they would be that uh, nice about just letting Riku escape their grip like that. Also, another stray probably implies that. Are oh, you a yeah. prisoner? I thought it was yeah. going to imply Sora. Looks that way. Name's Sam. I'm Riku. Where are we, Sam? 
We're on the grid. You're in luck. Mm -hmm. Only a precious few are granted light cycle battle privileges. Oh. Oh, I think I'm gonna actually have to do stuff the moment I get into this rather than Even ending things off. So lucky. Oh, I better get to it. I'll I gotta get to you. a save point. How hard can it be? You know, I did have to. I do have to say that that device is probably the coolest thing from Tron Evolution. I forget if it's from the original movie Tron. Okay. How do I attack? Okay, so I have to change modes to be able to attack in front of me. Oh, come on, I can't even attack in front of me like that? Nope, 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 nope. Oh, come on. Yeah. Oh, flyers. Okay, that's what this is used for. It's still so much fun doing this. This is way better than Sora's. Anyone else? Jeez, this is a long racetrack. Anyone else? Oh! We have a taker. Oh, I should have jumped. Come on, die. You know you want to. See, he wanted to. Wouldn't it be nice if that was the end? I love how easy that was. Reload. 
Riku! You made it. You escaped from the games. It was surprisingly yeah. really simple. No way off the grid. Wanna come with? No. You go ahead. Wait, what's the way out? Through the portal. Portal? Yeah. It's like a gate that opened when I came here. Once I'm back in the real world, I can delete Clue. And then... Then my dad will be able to come home. Your dad? He vanished. 20 years ago when he came here to the grid. But because he needed to protect his disc from Clue, he went into hiding. He's been trapped there ever since. But I'm gonna change that. I see. Sam, you mind if I go with you after all? To the portal? Sure. I'll take what help I can get. But first, there's somebody I need to meet. He's in the city. And we got a flashback, too. Jeez, cutscenes galore. I tried to get back, but I, I couldn't get to the portal. It uses massive power, and it can't stay open forever. And like a safe, it, it can only be opened from the outside. It closed on me, Sam. That's why I never came home. So the portal, it activated when I came in. So it's open now. Not for long. Only one millicycle. About eight hours. So we go now. We go home. We make a run for it. We get you Sam, out of here. Don't rush. What do you mean, don't rush? The portal's gonna close. My disc is everything, Sam. It's the master key. The golden ticket. The way out. And not just for me. What do you mean? Our worlds are more connected than anyone knows. Clue figures if I can be in... He can be out? With my disc, it's possible. And then what? Game over. The guy doesn't dig in perfection. What's more imperfect than our world? I can't let that happen. I won't. So what do we do? Nothing? It's amazing how productive doing nothing can be. Clue is planning something. We've known that for a while. It's his game now. The only way to win is not to play. Yeah, well, that's a hell of a way to live. But it is a way. Sometimes life has a way of moving you past things like wants and hopes. That's great, Dad. Keep telling yourself that. Good night, Sam. A little bit of exposition, and now we're going to end things off. Next time on Kingdom Hearts Dream Job Distance, we're going to be continuing Riku's story and trying to beat the grid next episode. Until then, this has been your host, Kozar Raspel. I'm going to see you in the next video and signing out.